Tussixes threw straw against wind. Has and Meg pushed out in Dumper's Royals toasted Charles Solid Heed. The author of a new book about the British royal family said in an exclusive interview on Today Monday that Prince Charles made a benign comment speculating about his future grandchildren's skin tone that was later weaponized against the royal family by palace insiders. Author Christopher Anderson discussed his bombshell new book about the British royals, brothers and wives. On Monday, November 29, biographer Christopher Anderson not only stood by his account of Prince Charles musing about Prince Harry and Meghan Markle's future children, but he also defended the heir to the throne's alleged behavior. In a very kind of benign way, Prince Charles, you know, started to muse on what their future grandchildren might look like. I mean, here's this beautiful biracial American woman and the world's most famous redhead. I'm a grandfather. Of course, we all do this, Anderson said. The author of a new book about the British royal family said in an exclusive interview on Today Monday that Prince Charles made a benign comment speculating about his future grandchildren's skin tone that was later weaponized against the royal family by palace insiders. Author Christopher Anderson, who has covered the British royal family for half a century, details the relationship between brothers Prince Harry and Prince William in his new book, Brothers and Wives, Inside the Private Lives of William, Kate, Harry, and Meghan. The new book claims Prince Charles once asked about the potential skin color of Harry and Meghan's future children. Anderson writes that Charles allegedly asked his wife, Camilla, Duchess of Cornwall, over breakfast, what do you suppose their children's complexion might be? Anderson writes that the conversation took place on the day Harry and Meghan announced their engagement. The author says it was an innocent conversation twisted into something negative by royal advisers and shared with Harry and Meghan. What I'm saying is that on the morning the engagement of Harry and Meghan was announced, in a very kind of benign way. Prince Charles started to muse on what their future grandchildren might look like, Anderson told Hodakot B. in Savannah Guthrie. Here's this beautiful, biracial American woman and the world's most famous redhead. I'm a grandfather, of course we all do this, speculate on that. But it was turned into something very toxic, it was weaponized really, by the men in grey who run the palace organization. A spokesman for Prince Charles told that this is fiction and not worth further comment. Meghan and Harry spoke about an alleged conversation about Archie's skin tone in their bombshell interview in March with Oprah Winfrey. Meghan, who is biracial, told Winfrey there were concerns and conversations among the royal family about how dark his skin might be when he's born. The couple would not reveal who allegedly said it but later clarified that it was not Queen Elizabeth II or her husband, the late Prince Philip. William defended the royals after the interview, telling a reporter, We are very much not a racist family. Anderson, who said on Today that he has multiple sources for all his reporting, also writes in the book about William's alleged concerns about Harry marrying Meghan after a whirlwind romance. William told Harry to take whatever time you need to really get to know this girl to which Harry angrily by allegedly saying, Who the hell do you think you are, brother? The book says. Anderson writes the relationship between the Sussexes and the royal family grew even more strained in December 2019 after Harry and Meghan chose to spend Christmas in Canada instead of with the family. A spokesperson for the Queen told the New York Post that we don't comment on books of this kind as to do so risks giving it some form of authority or credibility. Charles denied that he ever had this conversation with Camilla Parker Bowles, NBC News reported. From Barbados, where he is attending a formal affair, Charles said via a spokesperson that Anderson's account is fiction and not worth further comment.
wives, inside the private lives of William, Kate, Harry, and Meghan. The new book claims Prince Charles once asked about the potential skin color of Harry and Meghan's future children. Anderson writes that Charles allegedly asked his wife, Camilla, Duchess of Cornwall, over breakfast, what do you suppose their children's complexion might be? Anderson writes that the conversation took place on the day Harry and Meghan announced their engagement. The author says it was an innocent conversation twisted into something negative by royal advisers and shared with Harry and Meghan. What I'm saying is that on the morning the engagement of Harry and Meghan was announced, in a very kind of benign way, Prince Charles started to muse on what their future grandchildren might look like, Anderson told Hoda 